there somehow. Yeah, so I wonder what the stipulation is on... Can I... Yeah, okay, so... I am confined by the real world, because obviously I can see myself in the two different planes, but only the real world matters? Yeah, I have no camera controls or anything like that. Um, wait, can I just take... Hey, yeah. an elevator. Might no. as well see if it works. It does work? Okay, that I was not expecting. for I knew her real name. Oh, shit. Okay, Marianne, just take a deep breath and. This whole be from. Let go. Oh! Ah. Okay. There. A fuse box. Need some energy to spark it up. Okay, so I can gotta move fast. Walk the two planes independently. So I an out-of-body experience. It's like taking a plunge into nothingness. Stay under for too long and it just pulls you in. Turn down some of the game settings. It's starting to get pretty choppy. So am I actually on a time limit? Oh, I, my body's fading away. I see it now. <laughs> okay, Marianne. Now get your ghostly ass back and power up that elevator. <laughs> So I don't actually, that's weird that I can just warp back. when the okay so it doesn't matter so both have to exist for it to work 
So I can do the out of body. I can only do the out of body experience the one way. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So I'm assuming that's just to stop me. Just another tutorial. she go meeting room What is that? <gasps> A bug? Okay. Not getting through here. So I can't do that any time though. I can only do it when the game wants me to. Oh, I'm actually okay. <laughs> I was trying to do the shield thing, but you can only that is weird that you can only do it at like, certain moments. Sometimes she doesn't want to move the direction I'm trying to move her. few days. You'll get what you want. Ugh, that voice. I don't know why, but it gives me shivers. Well, 
Looks like the only way. Great. What was that? This room. It feels cold. Memories of grief, loneliness. The spark's too weak to absorb. It's like it's missing something. Some objects soak up moments from the past. Just squeeze what? in the right spot and let it pour out. What am I looking at on the right there? Okay. Sunflower weary of time. But I'm my sure favorite what I was nurse. doing there for a second. Oh, Mr. Tarkovsky, you shouldn't have. Please, it's the least I can do for all the good work you do around here. Huh. An actual happy memory. So there's more to this place than just doom and gloom. Ah, sunflower weary of time. For my favorite nurse. Oh, me. Okay, so I can just re listen to it. An old prescription. I know these drugs all too well. Hypophysine, Luspirum, Priscilla, Towski diagnosed with depression, hysteria, insomnia. Malnutrition treated with electro electroshock. Well, <laughs> refill six times. Okay, so I need a flower. Just walk on in there. Drain the blood tub. That looks really weird. <laughs> this thing isn't a razor. It's guilt. Shame. Regret. Uh, okay, no, it is a razor blade, though. Okay, so now I can cut the little flesh walls. Satisfying. Okay. <laughs> so, there we go. Um, oh, there. All right. This could be useful. 
The light of a memory strong enough to defy this place. You want me to read you another one, darling? Oh, look at this mess! Don't worry, I'll clean you up in no time. I'm here for you, my love. This man, Tarkovsky, he ended up as her patient? Wait, I thought this was a resort. Or is it a resort for, like, sick people? Because I. I didn't think this was a hospital. I mean, I know it's not a hospital, but... Sad nurse. The stairs not that yet, I guess. Let's just back upstairs. The camera switching is <laughs> doing a number on the controls. <laughs> Is this the same? No, I'm on a different floor. And yeah, I can walk through. Uh, hmm. But nothing in here. Yeah, it's interesting I can split the spirit, but I can't, um, I'm back where I was, right? This is, wait, oh, never mind, I did go back up, I, I totally forgot I went back up a flight of stairs, so I am back on the scene, okay.
I'm almost dead. Kind of changed sepia tone there a little bit. Oh boy. Reclaiming history. Fire erupts in the sky. Explosions echo across the wilderness. Sparks rain down from the ruins of Fort Pulaski. Once an impenetrable fortress that saw some of the most intense fighting during 1945 offensive against Hitler's forces. This time hour is not the bombs or the mortar fire lit up the sky. It's back the duh, but a spectacular display of fireworks that marked the grand opening of the Neo Workers Resort. Wait, so at the grand opening? Yeah, at the grand opening they set off a fire? Wow. Manager, huh? Marianne! Oh, Sadness! Hello. We gotta stop meeting like this. I told you to follow me! Take it easy, Sad. This place is huge. It's easy to get lost. Just, just stick with me! Okay. I'll stick like a tick. <laughs> <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> So does she know her Thomas arm is missing? Right. Or... All right. Listen, hon. You said you remembered someone named Thomas. Was it Thomas Rekovich? Was he the manager here? I... Uh, I guess. You think he stuck around? I'm not sure. There was an old man here. Very recently. I think. Oh. And you think it was Thomas? Oh, I don't know. Old men all look the same, all wrinkly and old. Blah. Hey, that's not very nice. <laughs> well, if he's still around, I've got an infestation to report. Marianne! Uh, I feel... Oh, uh, I don't think we should be here. It's okay, Sadness. Look, there's no one... here. Sadness? Hmm. Oh, wait, wait, is my... I'm looking at like my leg on the bottom there. I can't remember if it was that way before or if I've actually like been injured. <laughs> uh, it's almost complete. The main building turned out better than expected. Now it's just a matter of finishing up the less obvious parts of the resort. God damn, this place is perfect, remote, peaceful, hidden away from prying eyes. Talk about a hiding plain sight. Took some doing to convince them to let us stay. Luckily, I can't quite be persuasive when I need to. Oh yeah, I think I finally got it. I'll call it Niwa. Okay, so there's some dark secret going on here. Old invoices. Outdated documents. Wonder why someone put them out here. Well, the place has been closed for a while, so... It all hit me as soon as I entered the room. Anguish. Fear. Longing. I could instantly tell there was more to that clock than met the eye. Uh, Puzzle. Gotta set a specific time. Grand opening, I assume. Hey, is that the first secretary? They must have had some big plans for this place.
change this place to a day room. Question mark there. Why not this? Huh, this is signature. So he designed this whole place? Who are you, Thomas Rekovich? Yeah, he built this place for some other purpose. Someone's been using it. So it's just a, a flash, right? Like a, or is it, oh, or is it a full, yeah, it's a full flashlight. I thought it was a flash or a Too small to fit a door. <laughs> but it can fit a clock. As I moved the clock hand, I realized it was a junction between realities. It's rare, but I'd seen it before. Wait. I can feel... something's wrong. It's coming. Check the wire. I hate to get stuck in there. A spirit well. I could absorb some of that energy. Someone tried real hard to keep this place a secret. Wonder what's in here on the other side. Okay, so that's... Let's see if it worked.
someone jotted this down recently. Chin don't check. Almost half. Get the hotel, clear out the old papers, get out for research, develop photos if there's time, double check the office books, check up on boot. Burn marks? Broken glass and... is that salt? My senses jolted as I touched the phone. I could tell it had been used recently to call me. Switch or something here. I thought the whole point of what I was doing. 